everybody. Uh, we are in Brisbane today with Zen Zelda Marsh, author of Bounce Back Ability, Reclaim Your Power and Passion After Divorce. So Zelda, oh, oh my God, only three days ago this came from the printers. Yeah, yes. Friday the 13th. Friday the 13th. <laughs> so a little bit of a background on Zelda and then we'll ask us some awesome questions to find out about this book. Um, we met in Brisbane, not in this room quite, but was it about um, it 9 was or 12 the months? 20th of March, so two days time. Oh, my God, it's our anniversary. Yeah, yeah. yeah. at the class. Yeah. Um, the Chem Side is Brisbane book. Yeah. Yeah, so a year ago. So in two days it'll be the, a year since we met. Yeah. Then you had a little bit of a lead up to your retreat, which you did in November. So you had like a six month yeah, waiting period choice, where you were, yeah. yep, yeah. you're waiting. And then uh, you came to the November retreat, and then the book is exactly like I say, three to four months after the retreat in your hands. So tell me back if you can go back to a year ago, what was happening for you in your mind? How long had you been wanting to write a book for? And um, the trigger point. Oh, this makes me laugh this because I haven't had this life on dream or anything like that. I kind of haven't looked at the name, which would have been in the October before. Mm -hmm. So, what, five months before? Got it. Yeah. Yeah. That I was going to write a book and I'm like, yeah, because I haven't whatever. I don't, me and my people don't do things like that, you know? Yeah. So, um, obviously, the universe says says stuff and you came up on my news yeah. feed and I was like, don't normally attend this sort of thing. And I was like, oh, let me go have a look. Let me go see. And of course, obviously, I was overwhelmed with the whole um, workshop, and yeah. I was like, oh. So I had a talk with Stu, and he was like, yeah, love my idea, even though I didn't exactly know where I was going to go yeah. with it. Yeah. Um, so I had two days to think about it, mm. and I absolutely couldn't find a reason, apart from, for me, finances, not to do it. There was no other reason. So I was like, on the fifth hour, I have to do this. I have so to for do you, this. it was a fresh thing, came along, yeah. and, and just thought, yep. Yeah, Course, this is my next step absolutely right? yeah absolutely perfect. so bounce back ability what is yeah. it about it's about basically overcoming anything involved with divorce and, and life traumas really yeah so for women yeah. um obviously we go through lots of things being a mom a wife a child and the rest yeah. of it and it's basically about shit up and get over it you know this is yeah. you know ways just get over it. Don't hold on to it. Yeah. You know. Yeah. I love the cover, the pink. <laughs> I know. It was like a battle yeah. for me, but I absolutely love We went through like, it. like a sea of green when we yeah. were designing this and it just didn't sit right and then uh, <laughs> the bright pink Yeah, it just work. came yeah. from nowhere and I was I like, it. I didn't want to, but I absolutely do now. Now I've got pink everywhere. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> I love my pants too. Imagine your cover. Um, so tell me, what are your intentions now? Obviously, this only came to you in your hands three days ago. So, yeah, you know, early days. Okay. What do you want to do with it? Well, I'm already doing with it. Um, what are you doing? Because <laughs> um, I already run a business, yes. um, and I'm now transitioning into one on ones yes. rather than just online. Yeah. So I've already got my book launch date for my personal one. Yeah. And I'm already going to be doing monthly workshops from this Fantastic. because I have three programs designed mm -hmm. and I use them but I'm going to bring them to people in the flesh nice. so that's moving forwards so, so you're leveraging it's not just about this but it's about the other things that well, you it's, can help obviously with. my first thing is a message for the women yeah that's my first intention yeah. it's an inspiration and a, look, if she can do this I can do this kind yeah. of thing that's um, and that's what I'm going really to continue to do that's my first book haul yeah um there's a lot of uh, vulnerability in here because there's a lot yeah. of things that i hid away like yeah. a lot of us women do so yeah. it's been a bit scary, scary. really yeah. scary yeah. but you know hey yeah don't hide it so tell me then um how was the process of writing the book and you know coming to the retreat and what was it like for you because we hear from many different authors and everyone has a unique experience because they're a different person right yeah of course yes. okay for me i like following instructions so it was the like, recipe if you go, <laughs> yeah, yeah. If you got like the unpack was amazing and that was like um an eye opener for me because i was like oh wow yeah that made the book for me yeah um that was with Stu, as you know she's pointing over there because Sorry. she's sitting over there <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah so that that was really good that kind of made the book become a book in, in my eyes yeah um or at least the process of yeah. creating the book so we knew where we was going with that and then of course we've got our weekly 
meetings and they're online and hey now I need this or hey still need that which I did a lot of which said yeah. supports it hundred percent. Yeah. You know, you don't just it's not just about the book, it's about what we're going through as well. Because yeah, at least I struggled. I didn't know. Yeah. yeah, I didn't know. And obviously we all go through the like oh, well, I can't do this, I can't do this, yeah. I can't do this. I'm like, yeah, you can, yeah, you can, yeah, you can. Tell me the feeling when you open your box because I know it's still fresh in your... Did you... I, I heard you cry. <laughs> oh, my God. I opened it. I decided because I was on my own and I, I wanted to share the moment. And I was like, what do I do? Do I wait till I've got someone around yeah. me? Or do I do? I was like, no, just see you guys. Let's yeah. do this. Yeah. And I was opening the book thinking, oh, it's here, it's here, it's here. And I just lost it. I just yeah. absolutely broke down into emotion. So I just... Still now, it touches me. I just can't believe it. I'm like shaking in that phone. You see, I love it. Say. I love it, and um, I love that feeling. I know when I first looked at my first book in my hands, it was surreal that I had actually done something that I, you see in the movies, right? Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. awesome. So where can people buy the book? Um, on my website, which is www.manifestmerriment.com. So we will put it obviously in the comments. Um, yeah. uh, the spelling, you know, it's a little bit of a complicated <laughs> website. Oh, um, Manifesting Merriman after divorce. Yeah, Simple. yeah, beautiful. <laughs> I love it, and I can't wait to see what happens now in six and twelve months' time. And keep attending those online masterclasses. The journey it. really just has begun, um, and I want to like sort of almost do catch up interviews with people a year later which would be super amazing so thank you for being here today and also lending us a hand in yeah this hand. and uh, good, good congratulations good luck i think it looks amazing and you should be so proud like this is one thing that you can you have over so many other people who wish they have done it absolutely all right guys we're gonna um catch up with trish next so stay tuned we're gonna come back on live in a couple of minutes all right bye